Welcome, welcome. This is armchair based yoga. We're a little bit early, but uh, all of you are just waiting here, and so am I. So let's just introduce the class and slowly get started. And anybody that's joining us, welcome and join us when you can, right? So no matter what, in yoga, we always practice our good posture first, right? And so you can use your seat in order to kind of, as a measuring stick, if you will, to make sure that your back is pressed into the, the <coughs> not in, in the mat, in the chair. And then you know your back is, is tall. It's, it's not coming forward because then you come away from the chair. And then you want to think about rolling those shoulders back, down, and together so that you can reach down towards the earth and your thumbs are sticking out and you can even roll them out a little bit to engage those latissimus dorsi a little more. Now, today our focus is where our focus is. So where is our attention and where are we looking? So when we're in mountain pose, we want to look straight ahead. So if you find yourself looking down at the floor, likely you're not as tall as you could be. You could think about the crown of your head going towards the ceiling or being held up by a rope, if you will, or a rod, having that go all the way through you so that you're as tall as possible. So from here, we take a few deep breaths, inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the nose. And welcome to Armchair Based Yoga. My name is Renee. I'm a registered nurse, personal trainer, and a yoga instructor. I have level one and two, but I'm going to take um, Thai yoga, which is a form of yoga flow and massage techniques um, in just a week. So that'll be exciting to kind of try a new dimension of yoga, which I always like to, to add to my yoga practice, right? Big deep breaths. So we'll see what goodies I come back with when I get back from the conference. And let's take a few deep breaths just to put all that away, put our day away, and bring our focus to our breath, to our bodies, to this moment right now. Inhaling more deeply and exhaling fully. Now, a couple of breathing techniques that we can do to put our attention more in the breath is the three-part breath. So we inhale, chest, uh, middle chest, and belly, and then exhale the opposite, belly, middle chest, upper chest. So let's try that together. Three-part breath. Inhale, upper chest, middle chest, and belly, and then exhale, belly, middle, upper. And then again, and then out the same way, again, and then out the same way. Very good. So let's add a little flow to our yoga now, inhaling, reaching up, and exhaling, pressing the hands actively together as we roll our shoulders down and back. And release our hands to either side. So let's do that again. Inhale, reach up actively. Exhale, bring the hands to the heart center. Shoulders back, chest out. Good. Again. Feel those palms pressed together. Notice where our tension is right now. Like, what are we thinking about? Are we thinking about re reaching up? Are we thinking about our breath? Are we thinking about our palms? Those are all wonderful things. Big deep breaths, inhaling, reaching up like you mean it. Every fiber of you wants to reach up to the sky. And then pressing into our feet, into our sit bones to root our position. Let's get a little taller here. Exhale down. So we're going to add a little crescent moon. So we're going to inhale up. And then one arm is going to go down. And we're going to exhale over. Inhale, come up. Exhale the other side. That's it. Inhale, come up. And then release down. 
returning to mountain. And we repeat it. Inhale, reach, reach, reach. Looking up if you like, or just straight ahead, or closing your eyes. Rib cage open, big deep breaths. Inhaling, reaching up. Exhaling, looking under the arm or opening the rib cage. That's it. Beautiful. Inhale up. Exhale, release down. Shoulders back, chest out. Let's enjoy three more. Feeling each one as though it's brand new. Exhale to one side. Beautiful. Yes. Inhale, reach up, up, up. Exhale to the other side. Beautiful. Inhale, reach up first, and then exhale down. The reaching up really helps to keep our alignment. So let's really feel it. Reaching up, 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 getting as tall as we can, and then over. Beautiful. Yes, you've got it right there. Inhale, reach up, up, up. Realign. Exhale over through the fingers, through the side body. Inhale up. Exhale down. One more time to fully enjoy it. Inhale, reaching higher than before. Exhale to one side. Opening that rib cage, inhaling up. Exhaling to the other side. Inhaling up. And then exhaling down. Good, let's enjoy three deep breaths, finding our roots finding our sit bones, finding our feet and our relaxed face, maybe even finding a deeper breath, rolling those shoulders back and squeezing those rib cage together, or squeezing those shoulder blades together, sorry. Good job. Let's inhale up, bring the hands to the heart center, and get ready for a wide pose. So we're going to take our feet out as wide as they will go, so knees over ankles, Toes pointing out in the same direction. Big deep breaths. Good job, good job. Just so you know, I have shorts under here in case you're concerned, but it's all good. So reaching out, just because it's so warm out these days. Reaching out with our fingers, shoulders back, chest out, big deep breaths here. Now just holding a position is a wonderful way to feel our body, isn't it? One more deep breath reaching out with the fingers, just feeling the arms in the work here. Very good. Let's inhale up. Exhale out. And then, actually we'll just do that. Inhale up. Exhale, reach out. So just the sun pose, very basic. Feeling our arms probably right about now. Reach up a little higher and spread that sunshine throughout the room. Wherever you are, really, right? Big deep breath. Exhale out. And then one more, one more. Big deep breath. And exhale out. Good job, good job. So from here, let's relax our arms down. Our shoulders are back, our chest is out. And we're going to inhale and reach up. Exhale, come down. Hold here or rest here if you like. And we're going to exhale overhead, reaching as far as we can that way. Inhale up. Exhale overhead. One more. Inhale up. Exhale overhead. Inhale, come all the way up. Very good. And then take a deep breath and open up. Relax here or stretch down. Big deep breath here. And then exhale overhead. Feel that stretch? Inhale. Don't rush it. Feel it. Oh, right here, right here. That looks really good. One more. And then inhale. Come all the way up. Fantastic. So I got one more in this position. But let's release it for a minute and then go back out and see if we can go a little wider. A little wider. Good. Maybe, oh, see? A little bit of difference there, right? So let's do sunflower. Inhaling, scooping up. Exhaling, you do not have to touch the ground. You just go wherever you can and you start to feel 
that inner thigh stretch intensify. Inhale up. That's it. Exhale, swan dive down. So this is sun flower as opposed to sun pose. Yeah, so we're scooping up the sky. That's how I remember it. And then scooping the earth. Good. Three more. Good job. Two more, two more. Notice where you feel it. That's beautiful. Exhale, stretch down. That's it, chest down. And one more. Big deep breath. Exhale, stretch down. And if you can, see if you can touch the ground. If you can't, just hold on here to the inner thighs or here. Take a deep breath. I might come forward a little bit so I'm a little bit more comfortable. And then we're going to exhale up through the middle. Inhale. Shoulders back. Chest out. Exhale up. The other option is from here. Big deep breath. Exhale up. Inhale. Shoulders back. Chest out. Exhale up. Or here. Inhale, shoulders back, chest out, chin in, exhale up. Big deep breath, one more on each side. Exhale up, inhale, exhale up. Since we're here already, let's wrap our arms around our legs and relax our head down here. Big deep breath. One more deeper breath. Good. If you feel that deep stretch, now put your hands on your knees, lower back, and just curl yourself up really slowly, coming up with your chest. Very good. Or your hands to your lower back is also good. Really good. Good. So walk it back in. Feet hip width apart, shoulders back, chest down. We're going to do the half moon series, so squeeze your armpits. Shoulders are back, chest is out, chin is in, and you're pressing your hip forward. Should be space behind you to put your tailbone, right? Big deep breath here. And then exhale, roll your tailbone towards the back for cat. Inhale, chest out, shoulders back. Exhale, chest down, squeezing your body with your arms. Inhale, press yourself up. Notice the nice stretch at the bottom there. Good. Exhale, roll back. Inhale, chest out, shoulders back. Open up that chest. Yes. Exhale, press yourself forward. And at the bottom here, you'll feel a nice deep stretch. Inhale, come up. One more half moon series. Exhale, roll back. Inhale, chest out. Exhale, down. Inhale, push up. Very good. So from here, we're going to go into warrior two. So warrior one first. Just so we get the right position. Take a drink if you want one. Always. Anytime you need a break in yoga, feel free to take a break. Yoga is beautiful like that. But when we're ready, we begin with our, our feet sitting at the edge of the seat on the side. From this position... We take one leg back, like that. Got it, good. We inhale up. Good job. Warrior one. Then we open up our arms and our hips. See how the hips going forward? We want to open up the hips. So we're going to stretch the outside leg out where we can plant it. But this knee stays. So you get a stretch right here, right? Inhale, reach up. Good, big deep breath. Looks really good, yes, good, good. So inhale, reach forward, and then relax your hand down, and reach up with the other one. Very good, now we're gonna do the windmill. Exhale, down. Feel each muscle of your back get a nice stretch. Inhale, reach up. So if you wanna make it harder, stretch this arm down. Exhale, down, inhale, up, and three more. Windmilling our arm, we can look at it, we can look down, or we can look up. And one more. So from here, 
Good job. We're going to inhale, come up. Very good. And just do a nice reverse warrior two. Big deep breath here. Reach up, up, up. Exhale, find a deeper position. And one more. You can look straight ahead as well. And then inhale up. Release the leg and do your quad stretch. Almost always from that position we do quad stretch. Look at those nice quad stretches. Very good. Take a deep breath here. Press your hip forward. Good. One more deep breath. Looking straight ahead. Focusing on our front thigh stretch. And a deeper breath perhaps. Yes. Good. Release the leg. We return to the center for our half moon series three times. So shoulders are back. Chest is out. We're in our sphinx position. Exhale, cat. Inhale, sphinx. Exhale into our push-up or crocodile. And then cobra. Yes, good. Let's do it again. Exhale, tailbone towards the chair, pulling the abs in. Inhale, opening the chest. Beautiful. Exhale, chest down towards the thighs. Inhale, press yourself up with your arms. Last one. Let's really focus. Pulling those abs in with our cat. Inhale, our chests are out and open. Exhale, chest down. Inhale, pressing ourselves up with our beautiful arms. Very good, very good. So we're going to go to the other side now. So we begin sideways seated with our knee over our ankle. We find ourselves taking our leg back for a supported lunge. And lifting up. This is warrior one. Hip is forward. Rib cage forward. Take a deep breath here. Reach. And then exhale. Open yourself up and allow your hip to open up and your leg, your outside leg to stretch out and get planted. So it's going to be at an angle a little bit. So big deep breath here. And then as you inhale the next time, reach forward. Relax your arm here. Inhale up. Exhale. Windmill the arm down, feeling each one of your back muscles get a stretch. Or you can straighten the arm for a deeper stretch here. Plant both feet, grounding your position. Inhale and reach. Exhale, stretch those fingertips to get the full effect of this stretch. Inhale, reach. Exhale, windmill, and one more. Good job. Inhale, reach. Big deep breath here. Come on all the way back up when you're ready. Good job. And then reverse, reaching up and sliding down the leg. Big deep breath here. One more. Reach and deepen. And then come back and release. The leg and grab it for your quad stretch. Very good. Very good. Big deep breath. Press the hip forward, looking straight ahead, focusing on the front thigh. One of the biggest muscles in the body, the quadricep, which indicates four, four bundles of muscle. Quad. One more deep breath. Right? If you think about it in terms of names, quad has four, bicep has two bundles, right? So it's twice as big in the quad as it is in the arm. So really important to work those muscles. So let's begin again. We can sit all the way back for a little bit of support. We ground our feet hip width apart. Our shoulders are back. Our chest is out. We take a deep breath to find our mountain, find our, our foundation. Next inhale, we bring our arms really tight. Get ready for spinal balance. So you want to press one foot out. Reach the opposite arm. If you want it to be more difficult, you lift the leg. Take a deep breath here. Reach, reach, reach. We're going to hold for one more deep breath. 
And then we're going to do a crunch with it. We're going to exhale in. Inhale, stretch. Exhale in. Inhale, stretch. Exhale in. Pulling those abs in with you. Inhale, stretch. That's it. Exhale in. Inhale, stretch. Two more. Enjoying each one. Inhale, stretch. Exhale, crunch. Inhale, let's just stretch it. One more breath. Exhale, bring it down and realign ourselves to our mountain pose. Take a deep breath here. Next, inhale, we bring the arms up. Take the opposite leg and press it out. Take the opposite arm and reach it. Take a deep breath here. One more. Lift the leg if you want a harder workout. Good. And then exhale in. Inhale, stretch. Exhale in. Inhale, stretch. Exhale in. Enjoying three more. Reach and crunch. Reach. Beautiful. And crunch. I love the strength and the length. And crunch. Inhale. Reach, reach, reach. And then release. Take a deep breath here. And we'll just find our breath, find our feet. And just notice the difference in our bodies when we rest. Good. So let's sit closer to the edge of our chair. And we're going to get ready for chest expansion and hamstring stretch. So we're going to have our leg out straight, flexed foot, arms behind us intertwined or pressing back to open up our chest, tuck our chin in. Take a deep breath in and press the chest forward. Take another deep breath in, press the chest forward. Another deep breath, reaching back still, opening the chest, tucking the chin in, pressing the chest forward. And then one more. Good. And then come back up nice and tall. Reach back one last time, and then release the arms and shake them out. Let's do the other side. Take this leg out, flex it. You can soften the knee if you need to, right? So take away the chest expansion, reaching back. Sorry, itchy nose, reaching back, big deep breath. Exhale, press the chest forward, tuck the chin in. Reach back towards your buttocks, opening the chest further. Press the chest forward, tuck the chin in. Take a deep breath here. Press the chest forward. And then one more. Good. Then inhale, come on up. Before you release the uh, arms, take your ear to one shoulder. And then down. And then to the other shoulder. Good, and then back up. So if any of you out there drive, really important to do those neck stretches. So let's try a different one today. It's called goddess pose. So you want to have your feet together, and you may have to sit at the edge of your seat a little bit for this one, pressing the legs together. Let's hold on to the chair and just press our chest forward a little bit. Just feeling it. Big deep breath. Good. And then one more. Good. And then up. You feel this a lot more if you are um, in a seated on the floor position, but it's nice to practice it anyway. So let's put our feet down. Let's give ourselves a little hug. Good. And you know we're going into eagle's pose, really. So one arm up, the other arm. Intertwine them if you can. Pull both elbows down. Take a deep breath here. Good. Very good. One more deep breath. And then out. Out, out, out. And then hug the other way. Really trying to reach back there. Good. Big deep breath here. 
Pull those shoulder blades down. You can probably feel them. And then one arm up, the top arm, I should say. Wrap the other arm around it or both up and pull both elbows down, pulling the shoulder blades down with them. Big deep breath here. See if you can notice it in your own body, in your upper shoulders. Big deep breath. Very good. And then release. Let's sit all the way back. All the way back. We're going to inhale and reach up, up, up. And then bring our thumbs towards our back, pulling our elbows with us. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, down. Inhale, turn it upside down. Exhale, release. Let's do that again. Inhale, reach up, up, up. Press those palms actively together. Exhale, bring it back. Bring the elbows with you. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, down. Inhale, upside down. That's it. Wrist stretch. Exhale, release. Good job. Good job. So find yourself in a comfortable position. If you want to take a drink, please drink as much as you feel you need to because we could sweat up to two liters a day. One, one liter a day is pretty average. So on a hot day like this, could be two liters of fluids you um, perspire without realizing it. So make sure you drink lots and lots of water, okay? And even if you think you don't like water, uh, try to imagine that you're in the desert and it's the only thing to drink in your perch, so you have to drink water. And maybe all the world will like it. So let's just relax. Close our eyes, take a few deep breaths. Let's imagine that every breath we take is like, like a beautiful hug. So we're like embracing our bodies with our breath, let's say. So let's really think, because we're nourishing our bodies with each breath, aren't we? So with every deep breath, we begin to relax and feel comforted by the oxygen, by the breath. Taking a few deep breaths. And let's just imagine ourselves today in a relaxing place. So allow your imagination to go wherever it will go that's relaxing and safe. And imagine yourself sitting in this safe place and that your muscles can relax even more deeply because you're in this relaxed, safe place, comforted by every breath. And begin to notice in this beautiful, relaxing place with all that's around us, with all the relaxation we feel, with everything we hear. Let's take it all in and imagine relaxing more fully in our legs, in our ankles, in our knees, our hips. Taking a few deep breaths here. And if anywhere needs your specific attention, feel free to focus on it. To appreciate it, to notice it, and then to soothe it. Let's relax our, 
our shoulders, our arms, our, our hands. Let's imagine that our chest is open and relaxed. Our back is free and comfortable. Our hips are resting. And most of all, our face is relaxed and our mind is free. Big deep breaths. Let's think about setting the intention today that we will appreciate our bodies with a new look at them, with a new appreciation for what we have today. So taking a few deep breaths to feel ourselves returning to this space, feeling fantastic, rejuvenated, and just a lot more relaxed. We feel our legs and arms, our torsos, our shoulders, our faces and minds just wake up feeling fantastic. So good job today. Good job and namaste. I'm always so grateful for your practicing with me and have a wonderful day. I'll see you on Friday. Have a great day. Namaste.